This video was brought to you by Gallman. Stick to the end of the video for more info. Hello, my name is Kanazuka, and I will be reviewing the Gaoman S620 pen tablet. Using text-to-speech for privacy reasons, hope it isn't too annoying. As an iPad user, I was really excited to try this one out. 6.5 times 4 inches work area battery free pen, 1.9, 2 pen pressure, 4 customizable buttons creatively support Android OS, Mac OS, Windows OS. The tablet came with a pencil with the cover, the pen tablet itself, a micro USB, Android adapter, replacement nibs, and a quick start guide. Although the table felt really light, it is made with a pretty solid plastic. I specifically like the pen, it's comfortable, and a bit chunky and responds nice to pen pressure. It's been a hot minute since I drew something on a tablet, and I need to say that I genuinely really like this tablet. Really easy to install and do custom configurations. It's really cheap and definitely delivers on its price. Recommend for beginners or anybody that wants a basic tablet. I animated this video on Fireal Paka, basically because it feels like the same processes that I used when I animated on Procreate. It took longer than expected, but was pretty fun overall. For this tablet, it came with an adapter for most of Android devices, sorry Apple users. So you can plug it on your cell phone or tablet and draw with it. If I'm being honest, I had trouble with this mode. It was a little wonky, but pretty sure I is only my cell phone since I've been watching several reviews where it works perfectly. Just make sure you have it on phone mode. Instructions on manual. I think this tablet it is a pretty good cheap alternative to other tablets. Really easy to work with, and with the movable device feature makes it even worthy. Small and comfortable, I would totally recommend it. But if you can afford it, I will recommend any screen tablet over a screenless tablet. Hope you liked the review and animation. See you soon.